team captain on the mic. Yo, prepare to get educated. We're graphing lines, yeah, it's graphing time. If you hate graphs, you're no friend of mine. You can graph a curve, you can graph a conic, you can name a graph, and I'm on it. So intercept form is what the name implies. M is your slope, run under your rise. B's the Y intercept, use that inner intellect. Put that point on the axis, earn yourself some self respect. Sing it with me, it's really easy. Y equals MX plus B, that's our foundation, it's the easiest line. If you need it again, rewind. Yo, refresher on standard form in case you've lost it. AX plus BX equals a constant. To solve for your intercepts, make X or Y diddly, then connect the dots. I mean it, like literally. Point slope form might make you feel queasy with a slope and a point. It's really pretty easy. Why Minus a y point equals m times the quantity x minus x point. Next, we're getting caught. We're graphing lines, yeah, it's graphing time. If you hate graphs, you're no friend of mine. You can graph a curve, you can graph a conic, you can name a graph, and I'm on it. Parabolas are the conic section shaped like a half pipe. Let me shed some light on them, just like a flashlight. Change a times x squared when you move horizontally. K and h are vertices. Please graph responsibly. An ellipse is just a circle, but squished. If you gotta graph it, just remember this: these numbers down here are the squares of each axis. Now, can somebody please tell me how I'm gonna do my taxes? Hyperbolas are whack, so make sure that you listen. The terms down here are the squares of the distance. Draw your asymptotes lines; the curve will never touch. The positive term is the way you open. Up. We're graphing lines, yeah, it's graphing time. If you hate graphs, you're no friend of mine. You can graph. Curve, you can graph a conic, you can name a graph, and I'm on it. Oh. I made this beat. Period six multi. Shout out to the rooster. <laughs>